today I'm going to be showing you how to create your very own cold pressed virgin coconut oil. So I will be showing you the step by step process and how to do it at home. So if you all are interested, then let's get started. So I went to the market and then I bought an old coconut. Now you want to use the mature coconut because you can't really extract oils from the young coconut. So of course, all you need to do is cut the coconut in half and then from there you'll see the coconut meat. And then in the market they have this thing called the coconut grater and it's just an easy way of getting or scraping out the coconut meat from the shell. Now you can also buy this grater online. I'm gonna put that in the description box down below if you want to do this manually at home. So here is the grated coconut meat. Now he is going to put everything on this net and then he's going to put it under this coconut milk extractor thingy so he can milk out the coconut meat without adding water to it to get the pure coconut milk. Okay, so here is all of the coconut milk that he extracted. So when I came home, I placed it in a container and then left it at room temperature to ferment for about seven hours. You can already see a separation. So I decided to put that in the fridge so I can easily set them apart later. So after two hours, I got it out of the fridge and then I'm going to cut that layer and get that iceberg part and save that because whatever is left at the bottom, I'm just gonna throw it out just because it's just the water. Okay, so this is what it looks like right now. So now I'm going to cover it and leave it again to ferment for another seven hours to melt and ferment because I want to make sure that there will be no water left so after seven hours you can see that there's still water there so I'm going to get rid of that so I decided to put it back on the fridge for another two hours so that I can easily separate them later so when I got it out of the fridge I'm going to go ahead and slice through it and as expected you can see there that there's still some water left so what I am holding right now is the curd and the coconut oil I'm going to go ahead and save them and as you can see here I'm just going to throw out the water because we don't need this so at this point I am going to separate the oil from the curd so what I'm going to do is to just leave it at room temperature for three hours to melt and since it is very hot in my country it melted really quickly all right so after three hours this is what it looks like the oil is above and the curd is just underneath it so I'm going to carefully take the virgin coconut oil and transfer it in a container to store it Okay, so after all of it is done, here is our very own cold press virgin coconut oil. It was definitely time consuming, but it's all worth it. Also, if you put this in a fridge or store it in a cool place, it will solidify and it's going to look something like this. Now you can use this to remove your makeup, include it in your hair mask or your hair care routine. You can even include this in your skincare routine or simply just to moisturize your body. So that is it you guys, I hope you all liked this video and if you did, please give this video a thumbs up and also let me know in the comments down below what more DIYs or hair videos would you all like me to do, especially during this holiday season. So that is it and I will see you all in my next video, bye!